Hey guys, so today is June 2nd and just chilling here with Brooks. Fell asleep. He is now <clears throat> just over two and a half months old, 11 weeks, and he's doing pretty good. He's healthy. This past week he started to smile so much more. His head is um, beginning to get more uh, sturdy, stronger. Noticeably, I think when he's on his belly, he can kind of lift his head up and keep it there for a minute. No news from our court case appeal that we did. Our court hearing was the beginning of May, May 5th, and it's almost been a month starting to wonder why it's taking so long. I know a lot of these systems tend to be backlogged, but to think that it took, um, you know, I don't know, 20 days for her to make a decision seems ridiculous. And then it, you know, another few days for it to come in the mail. It's a little disappointing that it's taking this long. I feel like I hope the right decision is uh, is decided because it's going to be difficult to imagine going to state court to fight um, to fight what's happened to us. But I am wanting the truth. I think we deserve the truth. We don't deserve what we've been put through. We don't deserve the ramifications it's had on our life and. I want to be able to move forward with my life. I want to be able to feel like I can actually grieve and process. And a lot of kind of what's happened is not allowed me to process Allie and her passing and kind of make sense, if you can, of why this happened to us. But it's all been put on hold because of the legal system and feeling like we have to fight for the truth, fight for our future, fight for um, what we deserve is ours. And so it's just a little frustrating to um, be still here. And it's been well over a year um, since this all transpired and started. And it's just, uh, it's been tough but we look forward to making more content. I know uh, my family is excited that I'm kind of getting back into creating more and I just want to make memories, help other people. I think now more than anything, I think I'm <clears throat> getting more passionate about certain topics that I will share more and certainly things like minimalism with kids because it's been a huge challenge um, over the years recently to um, kind of be faced with the reality of what kind of abundance in physical ways that kids bring into your life and attract based on you know family gifting and other such things and so topics that relate to you know living simply the beliefs that I had back when I started building my tiny house and uh, the ways in which I was kind of altering my life then haven't changed uh, my beliefs haven't changed my values haven't changed but my lifestyle and my family has grown. And so the ways in which I can have influence, the ways in which I feel I should have influence regarding things and spaces and stuff ultimately, and the ways in which this stuff is affecting our life, my life, there's a lot more topics like that that I'd like to 
talk about, but um, this video is just a little update saying Brooks is doing really great and he's happy, smiley. I've got another appointment in a little over a month for him and uh, trying to stay positive and hopeful and optimistic about what life has for us moving into the future. So hope everyone is having a good day and I'll talk to you all soon.